<laughs> so what's behind the whole thing? What's behind behind? <laughs> what is the... Some people will say it's God. <laughs> well, it's, um, it's interesting because there are two forces um, that are created in this principle that sort of come back on itself as a toroid, toroidal, so like a donut shape. And um, I really think it's sort of, I call the book Inside the Mind of God. That's it's right. A yeah. bit of a joke, yeah. <laughs> you know, but it's also very serious, you know, it's everything, you know, it's got the duality. And um, because it's kind of like we are inside the big consciousness, the big one consciousness that um, is, uh, you know, at the center of every black hole that's, you know, in a fractal fashion at every level of us from our chakras to our atoms to our cells, it's all the same pattern. So... In, it, in the center of all of that is that infinity, and that's the infinite mind. So call it God, whatever, and I think what it's doing is knowing about itself through us, through um, not just us, but every single experience out there through that chair, through the water bottle, through, you know, the plant, everything. It's getting, this mind of God is getting to know itself um, by pretending to be separate and uh, sort of uh, coming back on itself like that. So it's almost self-referencing itself. And it is very much science, I was going to say going back, but I think that probably isn't the case, but it's science again meeting mysticism and spirituality. Yes. Because uh, a mystic and a spiritual person will say the same thing, really. Yes, yeah, you're getting to that point, and I think, um, you know, science at the end of the day is a human construct of our age. And uh, so at the moment, science and mysticism is um, meeting um, the, this human construct that we have. At the end of the day, all there is is the universe, and the universe sort of behaves in certain ways, and it can fit into our model or, or um, of the human construct of science or, or not, you know. And I think um, pretty soon we're, we're actually going to go beyond the construct of science and just, you know, think of things in a wider perspective where we're just learning from the universe itself, you know, and whatever label you want to put on that, you know, I think we are going into this new paradigm. It's a very exciting time. Whether we want to or whether we've been dragged along with it, we're going there. Anyway. Yes, exactly. Okay, Manjir, thank you very much for coming in and, and talking to us about punk science, inside the mind of God, and thank you for watching Conscious TV.